What's going on guys, it's Pixelated, and today we are looking at a bunch of fire, and I know what you're thinking, no, we're not staring at campfires like a bunch of buffoons, we're out here starting our own. Okay, so this is what's actually happening in this video, so I know I'm always hitting y'all with the sneakers most of the time, but you know I gotta get y'all fresh and laced up from time to time too, and streetwear I can rock that's good quality, it's got the look I need, and you can get it for a good price, especially since it's back to school, I know y'all want that good price for that good look, and it's one of those days, man, where I get to see whether all of that comes together or not. I was out here looking for all of those things and a clothing company by the name of Guapi was gracious enough to send me a package of some goods. Guapi spelt with a V, but I'm pretty sure it's pronounced Guapi. I don't know how you can pronounce Guapi or whatever. Let's hope I got it right. Anyways, they sent these a while back, so I can't really unbox or unpackage them for you, but I can tell you if Guapi clothing is right for you. Feel free to like and subscribe at any point during the video if you enjoyed it. Now, let's peep this package. Not like that. You know what I mean. Alright. So starting off with the first article of clothing, it's the Obsidian Black Track Pants V2. Now usually when I buy bottoms, I like to try them on and see how they fit. This is one of the biggest concerns for me when I'm buying online because I'm afraid the fit will always come out bad or they won't fit at all or they'll be too big and it's almost always difficult to tell how it's gonna turn out if it's your first time buying a certain pant or from a certain brand and you're doing it online. So I usually go for a size large with pants I buy online even though I'm a true medium just because one, I want to ensure I'll at least be able to wear them and get them on and two, I have thick thighs so I might even get a little uncomfortable wearing my true size. Thankfully these pants fit great in a size large for me. If you're a regular slim build you can most definitely go your true to size. The pan itself is made of a super soft polyester fabric, it's very light, very breathable, and is soft at the same time. They've got that fresh zipper on the pants look and the long drawstrings, which really add that aggressive look. The white stripes along the inside and outside are a very nice touch and make an otherwise plain all black pant into something more interesting. You can now wear monochromatic shoes with black and white mixes without feeling out of place. The cuff of the pants isn't too snug, and this isn't something I'd wear with shoes like the Yeezy 350v2, because I don't like anything overlaying those shoes, they're meant to be worn with something with more of a taper. I'd rather wear them with joggers or very tapered pants that cut off at the ankle. As you can see, I'm rocking them with my Yeezy 500 blushes and that's exactly how they're meant to be worn with chunky shoes or classic Jordans such as the 1s and 4s. Now obviously you're not limited to that but you get what I mean. Wearing these with more sleek modern runners might not be the look you're going for although you can most definitely pull it off if that's what you want to do. But if you want some good essentials, something that's low key that'll go with everything and is comfortable and lightweight at the same time this is your go-to pant up next we have the biker track pants v1 in the black red white colorway and before i go any further i just gotta commend guapi on the packaging the package might have came in a bag but each individual item was packaged in their own guapi branded bag which is always a great touch in my opinion now i have these bags chilling ready to be used for whatever i may use them for in the future but not just that it just gives you a whole premium purchasing experience when you feel something like that or when you experience something like that the materials on this this pair of pants is similar to the pants right before. It's a polyester cotton blend. It's 95.5% polyester and 4.5% cotton. Super light, super breathable. The pants have long drawstrings, an elastic ribbed waistband for maximum comfort, and they really are comfortable. Once again, I got a size large and it fits great, comfortable, just the right amount of slack. The color blocking on these pants is what stood out to me the most. Oh yeah, by the way, I didn't choose the items that were sent to me. Guapi sort of just said, we'll send you some things and here they are. So just keep that in mind for the rest of the review. I think I got to pick maybe one pair and that was this pair that you're seeing right here. Either way, let's keep it moving. The color blocking is great. Good colorway to rock with something like Chicago's, Bread Toes, or ahem, ahem, Nike Cortez. Oh, and it just so happens that I'm wearing the Nike Kenny Cortez with this pair of pants. That's the Nike and Kendrick Lamar collab. These pants do have a unique distinct feature that I've yet to see on other pants. The end of the zipper on the pant legs are covered with a strap that clicks in to secure the pant leg opening more to your ankle. And I'm pretty sure they could have just done that with a zipper, but I like that they did it this way. Not only because it's unique and adds to the look of the pants, but it actually makes the opening a little tighter so it hugs your leg a little better. Sitting off your shoes just that much nicer. These are not simple track pants by any stretch. If you're wearing these, you're standing out. They're a statement piece while the previous pair was more low key, but still stylish, still breathable and light so you can wear it however you like. 
So if you're looking for a bold and comfortable set of track pants, this is your calling right here. They have plenty of other colorways on their site too, using the same color blocking. So if red is something you're not into, you can definitely look into one of those. With that being said, moving on to the next item. Last but not least, we have these two items from Guapi that I chose to wear together. We have the cutoff flannel V3. I'm not sure why it's V3. There's no real reason, but I'd assume they went through two other versions before that they weren't happy with and they were happy with the third version so that's what we got then we have the basketball drop crotch shorts v2 again the v2 probably means the first version was scrapped for a better improved v2 version the cutoff flannel is a somewhat unique piece that i've never really seen myself wearing i'm not really sure why maybe the cutoff sleeve holes are too big or i thought it defeated the purpose of a flannel but in fact i really like this note i'm wearing it with a hoodie underneath so i could just show a variation of how you could wear it but it is often worn on its own so if that's what you're into go for it it is better in hot weather anyway to do that the flannel has cut off sleeves and leaves the outer edges frayed and unfinished this is probably my second favorite part of the flannel after the zippers on the side there's nothing more liberating than grabbing these zippers and pulling them up for more range of motion yes i said range of motion no this is not a p90x workout video that is an old reference but yes pulling up the zippers still makes me feel more comfortable this pretty much takes the things i love about a flannel like the red navy checkered pattern the soft material the button up style and makes it summer friendly and breathable and if guapi didn't send me this cut off flannel i probably would have never got into this look so thanks for that now i paired the flannel with the basketball drop crotch shorts i'm not really sure if these are drop crotch shorts the crotch area of these shorts seems pretty normal to me nothing too droopy or loose that sounds like a weird way to describe basketball shorts but they really just feel like non-drop crotch basketball shorts and i've just said crotch way too many times maybe i'm just being picky they do seem very relaxed though aside from that these are great they're polyester so they're light and breathable the elastic waistband sits very comfortably on my waist i love the drawstrings the length of the drawstrings really contrast with the length of the shorts i will say one thing though these shorts are a tad too short for me i typically like wearing shorts at or below the knee and that's just personal preference these shorts are designed like classic old basketball shorts with the angled cut on the sides so that might explain their length but they're so comfortable that i might make an exception once in a while a really cool feature of these shorts though is that they decided to put the zippers on the pockets so for example when you're walking by a ball court decide to shoot up some hoops for a quick minute you don't have to worry about your phone or wallet popping out of your pockets and falling to the ground because you got them zipped up the shorts also have two back pockets with these very prominent flaps I'm not really sure why they're so prominent, but it does add a different look to these shorts than what you would normally get and emphasizes the booty. <laughs> they're a red black colorway, very reminiscent of the Chicago colorway. And if you're into more creative shorts, they've dropped newer shorts with fresh floral patterns since I got my package. And there you have it. That's my haul from Guapi. If you want to see what else they got, feel free to check out their site, guapi.ch. I'll leave a link in the description. What did you guys think about the clothing? Is it something you'd rock or do you have a different style entirely? Why? Let's hear it in the comments. Catch you later. Pixelated is getting that guap.